Hey guys, Uter Vulture here. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, bringing you a new video here of Starfield. We got our newest update here. What an update I've been really looking forward to just to really play through and test out, which is adding vehicles. Now before jumping in, I want to go ahead and note a few things here, especially with the channel. Uh, first things first, showing again, playing this at max settings here on PC. Now, as we're also jumping in, uh, especially with this gameplay video, I want to note a few things about the channel. If you're new to the channel, I make two versions of every video, a POV version and screen recorded version. Depending on the video you're watching right now, you can find the alternate video linked in the description. Also, there's a few ways to support the channel, which include, uh, first off, if you're curious about anything in my setup, especially from the POV video, like lighting. Again, my entire setup is in Amazon links down in the description. If you check those links out, I do get commission off them, but I do greatly appreciate it as it supports the channel directly. Also, I do have a members section of the channel, members of the channel to get early access to this and all of my videos. Again, it is another means of supporting the channel, and if you are interested in that, I really do appreciate it if you check those out. And again, check out that members uh, playlist just to see the videos that are in early access. Now, super excited, like I said, about trying this update out. Here we are just kind of wandering uh, in space here. Now, what we're going to do is uh, land... So I have pulled up, or I've, I've, I've tested it out a, a little bit. Again, I just want to kind of put it on screen so you guys can see what the, the rover looks like. What we're going to do, I mean, we're just over here in the, uh, by Aquila City, basically, because in terms of buying it. Um, here, we're just going to go ahead and land over here. There's an industrial outpost on this side of the planet. Now, as we're doing this, I'm really enjoying it. Now, th this solves one of the, I guess, uh primary issues I had with this game. Well, let's finish the landing sequence. All right, here, let's exit. Now, the, here we go, here's my, here's my rover. Now, it's kind of cool, you can customize it. There's just this one right now, it, but I mean, the way they, they talk about uh, or mention, what the, why are you running towards me? We're gonna get in here. Um, the way they talk about it, though, it's like they're going to add more. So, there we go. So, super excited for that. Now, as I was mentioning, this solves, uh, in my opinion, one of the biggest issues I had with this game, which is the this planetary exploration. Uh, again, it, it was just, there was so much space. But, oh my, oh my goodness, there's a lot of aliens here. Oh, we're going to go away this way. Um, there's just so many, uh, so much empty space, right, in between what you're seeing and exploring on each planet and like your points of interest and so again it was just kind of frustrating right to, to walk you know 700 meters 800 meters with this again it feels great um obviously you get the boost in two types right you get your your standard turbo to go faster but you also have like the uh called like a jetpack boost right kind of like when you're on foot um now i do want to highlight that because i didn't actually realize that for like the first maybe 30 minutes i was driving around I actually found the traversal a little, uh, admittedly, a little bothersome because I just kept hitting stuff, you know, hitting rocks, and you're like, okay, this doesn't feel any faster when you're constantly crashing. Uh, when I realized you have this little jump boost here, it actually changed everything, right? You can actually just kind of hover over those rocks as you see them, right? Or kind of these little mountainscapes and just keep going. So, yeah, like I said, really, I do really enjoy it. Um, I'm going to be curious to see maybe even what uh, some modders do with this, uh, with this update because... I would like to expand personally the uh, the boost capacity, but yeah. So overall, like I said, I do like it. First person view is looks good, although I'll be honest, it's it is just easier to drive this way. Here, in the spirit of, we're gonna bring up the surface map. I am just genuinely curious if there's other stuff around here. We already kind of drove by that. Here, that's fine. I just want to put a. Here, we'll head over there. By the way, another little thing uh, worth noting: when you are out on a planet surface, uh, and you let's say get out of the vehicle and go do some other stuff, um, you can fast travel to it. Again, something else I uh, I learned, which is actually kind of convenient. Hey, there's a bounty here. No time to chit chat. I'm here. 
<laughs> Persuade. Have you been taking Aurora? That's a crazy thing to say to someone. Damn it. I can't fight this, can I? Are you kidding? The system isn't gonna let me. Do you feel Whoa. powerful? I bet you do. I don't have time for this. Whoa, that was weird. Was that... Dude, did the audio just fail? Like a defaulted, <laughs> like, sub-system voice? That's actually kind of hilarious. Uh, you gotta love it. I mean, look, I do love this game. I, I, I enjoy I playing it for what it is. I thought the construction job would be easier. Joke's on me. Yeah, I'm not, I don't, I don't feel like talking here. Um, you know, I, I, I dig in. I, I do enjoy this game for what it is. I mean, it's a Bethesda game. It is kind of hilarious that I do feel like this update added some, uh, some, here, let me fast travel the ship, added some uh, extra bugs. Um, I don't know if I anyone else had this. It. I am genuinely curious if anyone had this actually in the comments. Uh, when I first loaded this update, all the planet skins were like just showing like the default, like it's you know not loaded right. Basically, that the texture needs to be placed over the 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 globe object in this case. Um, thankfully, that's not happening here in this video. Now that this is the I hope I opened it a few times. I guess maybe that's that was the fix. I don't know. But let's take off here. Alright, did the buggy thing. Let's go ahead and just find an actual planet and some missions to do. Let's take a look. Obviously, there's not nothing too crazy happening over there. Um, I'm curious about this. What is... Is it just showing me that this is an... an Wait, is it, is it just that it's an asteroid? Is there something there? It's, it's actually interesting that that's labeled. Hold on. I'm sorry. I, this, I'm just genuinely curious. I want to go see what's over here. I wasn't expecting to see all this. Ooh, shipping crates. Interesting. I'm obviously guessing some people crashed here. I'll take that. Where's the other one? There was an there was another one over here. Here, this one's kinda close. Sweet. Okay. Um, I don't even know what mission I have active, but I do want to land on this. Uh, this says extreme environment. So can I not land on this? Oh, frozen planes. Oh, no, I can. Eh, I'm not really. I don't. Honestly, I don't think I'm that interested. And in, I mean, it's not explicitly showing anything is on here. It just says extreme environment. Yeah, no, we're good. Let's go ahead and view our uh, mission log, because I need to see what I have active. Oh, tracker lights. I forgot about this. They, I, I just, just I ran into their agent. Let's go ahead and see what that's about. guess we're going to go right back to Aqu Aquila City. Things for you. The service is run through all these people. You know, I know the, I know the buggy loads next to your ship and even does it here. I've never actually tried. I wonder if I, I wonder what happened if I tried to drive it through here. Why? Something you 
might be interested in. Roach, I know I trust you, but record streak. I'm only one away. Again. Roach. You know what happened the last time I was paired up? I don't want it. Roach. This new one to... What? Our new potential recruit. He's standing, standing right Standing right here. Yeah, I said I know. I'm aware of his presence. Have been since he walked in the door. I said what I said. Uh, so I guess I I'm working with him. By and rookie, don't you dare Roach. let me down. Let got a talk. lot to prove around here. The hunt continues. I hope you fare well. What is happening, Great right Owl? Good trait for a tracker. Anyhow, we can talk about punctuality or we can get down to business. I am agent number one, or no one, if you prefer. It seems you've decided to entertain our offer. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Of enthusiasm can create an ocean of success. Remember that. However, it is not as simple as accepting and taking an oath. You must be tested in the field. Do you I have figured. any questions before we? <laughs> Good the point. The boards are merely a tool we use to expand our reach to freelancers who either do not have the capabilities or, the to put it simply. Those bounties are trifles compared to what official trackers deal with. They're lower risk. Sure. All right. Well, let's do it then. Excellent. Before we accept you as an official tracker, to that end, I would like you to first accept the available bounty on the wanted display on the nearby wall. But the jails are starting to fill up, thanks to you. Ooh, first step. Good. You have your mission. Once you are a tracker, you may not get a briefing like this for your missions. You'll be expect. The Trackers Alliance facilitates bounty hunting. We don't hold hands. For all intents and purposes, you may utilize our resources, including our database if need be, but you cannot expect someone to be with you every step of the way. Excellent. I knew you could. The target for this mission is admittedly one of our toughest. Not because of how dangerous he is. His name is Hannibal Eutropio. He's wanted for 94 counts of spaceship. We have reason to believe he runs a chop shop somewhere out in the fringes. But luckily, we have intel that one of his associates, Adrastos Dakota, for your first mission, you were assigned a partner, Roach. I work alone. Yeah, actually, I'm curious about Roach's attitude. Roach has been instructed that if he wants to continue in our... He will get over it. He always does. I... Roach is one of our best trackers. You would do well to learn. I wish you the best of luck. Sweet. Can I take one of these? Never mind. No, I can't. Can I take those? No. All right, Roach. What are you standing around for when there's fugitives on the loose? Hey, so, uh, about earlier. <laughs> That's a I accept your apology. Oh? <laughs> That's awfully big talk, but I dig it. There's a chance I might even be beginning to like you. Don't get cocky. You've got a lot to learn before you're in the same building as me, let alone the same level. Hmm, do I, do I want to be cocky, or do I want to actually ask about what happened? I was doing great until I volunteered to partner up with a rookie like you. They ran in, guns blazing, got shot up, and we had to evac. So I couldn't save him either, so... But now, I'm being voluntold that I need to partner up with you for reasons... Interesting, okay. I know you think you're hot shit, but... If you don't have the skills to back it up, the only tip I'll be asking you is where are all the best men? Now let's get down to business. This Adrastos guy is our ticket to finding Hannibal. We find him, bring him in, and get the information. Let's just Great. go for it. 
Adrastos was last sighted in town, so we're going to go out there and you'll use your scanner to find him. Once we do, we'll convince him to chat with us. By force. Eh, we're good. Don't get yourself killed out there. It's nothing. Yo, inevitable. I'll, I'll just make him on my side by proving myself. All right, let's go find who we're hey, looking for. Hey, Drastos is likely wandering the streets around here. Open up your scanner and look for anyone with a bounty. We may need to check other areas. Well, that's fun. So I gotta go. Do, I gotta do all this now. All right, well, we got to have to start doing a lap here, basically. Oh, hello. You really got I know there's a soccer field out here. I'm, try, I'm trying to wander through like alleys and everything too. All right, hopefully I don't miss them. We'll go up top. Are you that newcomer that saved Mr. Crowley? Wait, is this him? It is. Nice. Scan any promising leads. Hey, uh, can I help you? I want to go for the easy one. Nope. Maybe I can. Maybe I can. <laughs> uh, I'm kind of debating. Yeah. Nope. Ah, wrong. I know that a bounty for someone like me calls for bringing me in a lot. Nope. Yeah. In fact, it's in my own personal best interest. You really need to work on your technique, you know that? You couldn't convince a beggar to take a loaded cred stick. I bet I could convince you to take my boot up your ass. Start talking, or we'll find out. Wow, okay, yeah. See, that guy's good. You should learn from him. So, you're looking what? for Hannibal, right? Tell us where he is. Now. If your intel's good, Maybe we won't throw you to the Ashta. Because I'm sure Mr. Tall, Dark, and Menacing over here will make sure the rest of my existence is both painful and human. What are you, an Echo? I got... Truth is, Hannibal could be anywhere. I don't know how to tell you where he is. I don't believe you. You better start... But, but... But I know where to find his chop shop. <laughs> Reading you loud and clear, Chief. It's an old abandoned star yard in the Andromas system. Andromas 4A to be exact. Surrounded by a... Actually, you can. That's kind of the point. Great. You're coming with us, then. You run, you die. You cause a commotion, you die. You saw I die. I think I get it. Well, what are we waiting for? Right. Hey, rookie. What? Now I gotta talk to Roach. So normally, you'd register Drastos with the system and leave him bound for someone to come pick him up. But now, if we show up in my ship, we'll lose the element of surprise. I'd rather keep our cards close to our chest. Too many unknowns. What if he's got a crew waiting for him? What if he's got a way to jettison us into space? 
No. See, the last guy I took in wound up dead and knowingly donated his ship. We'll use that. Drastos here is gonna help us. Oh, I am? Or he'll find himself in. He's going to play it as if he jacked a ship and brought it to be chopped up. And he's going to do it without giving it away that we're on board because he know. As I was saying, I'm going to do just that. Take the flame, that's hilarious. Alright, well, let's just get going. Great. Let's get the ship's parked at the spaceport. You'll be the one in the pilot seat, so I can keep an eye on her. Well, that's easy. Can I just can I just can I please just transport over there? Or fast travel, I should say. Yeah, perfect. I picked up something you might be interested in. I wonder if I get to keep wait. Uh this is not the ship. Can you have a moment? There it is. Oh, this ship is way less cool than mine. Oh, it looks cooler. We'll do that one. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Now, I think they... I mean, I'm, I'm assuming this is far away, right? We're going to have to travel what they say, the outer limits. Where are we going? Oh, that's not that far, actually. sap and Aquila. I need to bring it into the shop. You got room? She's a beaut, all right. We'll get those numbers filed off, and then we'll decide if we want to keep her as is or strip her for parts. Bay 1 is almost free. You're clear to dock with it. See you on the inside. See? Look at that. Smooth and easy as chunks pile. Let's see. Make sure you're suited up and ready for anything. Easy part's over. Expect resistance once we get inside. Something tells me they're not going to take kindly to us. Yeah, for some reason that Probably seems suspicious. Not. Hey, uh, what about me? Don't you? You're staying right here on board. We're locked behind us so no one can get in or out. You know, just in case you were hoping for your friends to help you. Me and my partner will go in and grab Hannibal. We'll be back before you. Sounds like you got it all figured out. 
I'd say good luck, but that doesn't exactly work in my favor, so... I don't know. Don't right, just gonna cut him off. Okay, rookie. Remember, they shoot at us, that's on them. They chose them. Of course. Anything fun in there? No, I don't need that. Right, let's just keep going through here then. Gotcha. Gotcha. Where's the other one? I love these zero G fights. This is this is one of my favorite. Some of my favorite elements of this game come out in, in this. All right, there we go. Yes, I'll take that. Uh, oh, I, for I totally forgot I had Sarah here. Here, there, there. I just want to see what the, uh, what this guy had on him. Kinda. Um, so we got through this area. I'm guessing it's <laughs> space for troublemaker. It's funny, funny name here. I guess I'm go going to go through here. Oh, interesting. I so I need a command tower key. Take that, I don't need anything else. What do you have? Keep going this way. Ooh, that was a good shot. You guys got anything useful while I'm in here? That works. Alright, I'm just trying to follow my, my compass here see where I see them. I'm guessing they're up top. Or up high. Get here. Get here. Oh, beautiful. Okay, so we got the key. Dude, I, I wish the melee combat in this game was better. I, I don't even use it. It's just... I don't know. That... If it was like, you know, if it had more of that cyberpunk style or feel, that would be awesome. Wait, did he run away? Uh, the last enemy? Huh, I don't know, but let's get over there. Back to the command station center.
What I what I what I shoot? That was weird. Ah, uh, not good. We're just gonna go down the way here. Wait, I need that. Hold on. There we go. Got the trauma pack. Here, let's go back up top. That's where I came from, right? Alright, well, let's, let's actually just go follow the, uh, the mission indicator here. Interesting. How do I get back over there? a way to fire so I'm guessing that's the pot right wait what the oh I thought <laughs> thought that was another spacer Okay, so I need to find another key now. Okay, so obviously it means or it's in a locker. What else does it want me to get information on? Was there anything else in here? I guess on the living quarters. Oh, I have the razor leaf. Okay, that's cool. What's the override? Okay, here we go. Perfect. Okay, that's what I needed to do. Let's go ahead and keep it moving. I want to 
pull this out. Easy. You guys got anything cool? Not that. There they are. I knew that. I knew there was someone else. and get back over this ship. I want to get out of here. I believe the yep, entrance is right here. Oh, nice. I'm guessing it did it, right? Is that what I needed to do? Okay. Well, nice. Let's go see the damage. is one way to handle it. Where'd this guy go? There you are. There, do some special damage, come on. What is that? I don't know. I don't know what that is. Oh, is it melee? Man, that actually sounded kind of cool. Don't shoot! I give up! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold up! You got the wrong guy. I'm not Hannibal. I swear. I just work for him. I'm not! I swear! The jig's up. I'm done. I want out. It's like this, see? Hannibal rarely goes out. But when he does, he goes under an assumed identity and... Sometimes it's a Drastos, sometimes it's Chase, Jackie, Scotty, whatever. He's got a hundred of them. It's Wait a minute. The so did I have him caught. the whole time? I'm just Deke. Deke Han... What the fuck? I don't want to 
to believe him. Uh, yeah, we did have him. Izzy, you might want to go to the window and take a look, because it looked like he was pretty free and uncuffed last I saw him. Son of a... I'll keep an eye on Deke. Go hello, tracker. Yep. By now, you've probably found my associate Deke and learned that he is not, in fact, me, and that I am not who I said I was. Darn it, I know, right? Anyway, if you look out the window, you can see I'm taking your beautiful ship. Thanks, by the way. But don't worry, I won't leave you stranded. I'm not that bad a guy. You'll find a container nearby with a cute old junker that should hold up long enough to get you home. I've left you some other goodies too, just so there's no hard feelings. It should unlock now. As for me, I think I'm out of the stolen ship business after this, so I won't trouble you anymore. So long, and thanks for playing. Win. Ah, almost makes it hard to hate him. <laughs> almost. Well, we gotta get back to HQ. Let's see what he's left us and hope he's not luring us into a death trap. Well, man, of course, of course that would be the twist on this, right? Well, I guess this I I guess I officially have this ship now. Well, I guess that's one way for this to start. Well, anyways, with that I am going to go ahead and end the video here. This obviously is the end of the mission and not what I expected. Um, now this is going to be part one. I'm doing uh, this will be a two part video. Um, I'll continue recording, so second part will be available as well. Like I said, with that ending it here though, let me know in the comments what you guys think, especially if you have any questions at all about any of my settings or anything like that. And yeah, I appreciate y'all for your support. Please don't forget that like button and subscribe, and I'll talk to you later.